hi to everybody. Can anybody tell me what day it is today? That's the 9th. Sight timber. We're going really fast too, people. Hold on. Whoa, we almost missed that turn. All right, close up the old helmet. I've uh, lost so much weight that my helmet doesn't fit my face anymore. <laughs> so, I'm hoping, so most manufacturers of helmets, they only make two or three different actual shell sizes. So I'm hoping that this 2X helmet is also a 1X and I can just get new cheek pads and whatever else I need inside the helmet to make it fit a little bit tighter on my face because it is wobbly. And that's the correct word for it, wobbly. And uh, I've done this road already this year. I've done it a couple times. So I did it on the white spider and I was extremely upset because uh, this thing just would not handle. So I came back down on the black spider and I was like, ooh, this is almost dragonist. You know, like the tail of the dragon. We got some really good corners on this road. Ooh, of course, there's not a lot of traffic because that's how we like it. That's a cute house. Oh, look at all that gravel coming out of the turn. Or not gravel, but grass. Oh my goodness, peoples. Come on, people. Um, yeah, I came down here flying. Look at that. Oh, that's, oh, that's not good. That means it's going to get cold. Um, so I came down here. I was flying, you know, doing like a million miles per hour on the Black Spider. And uh, came over a, a turn. Well, a hill and a turn. And I was like, oh, and I had to get on the brakes pretty good. <laughs> like, pretty good. To where I was like... Oh no, <laughs> am I gonna make it? Why is there so much crap in the road? Um, but it's Buena Vista. It's right off of 33. And it is a fantastic ride. Like a lot of these roads through here. I need to follow that road. I have not followed that road back down. That's a, that's a black spider road. This nose is too low and I'll rip it off. Hey, anybody need any maters? And there are some maters. But yeah, I'm uh, almost 40 pounds down, which is incredible. I kind of stopped. These last five pounds have been um, kind of hard to lose, to be honest with you. Um, but we'll see, you know. I'll keep doing what I'm doing. Oh no, I see a car up there. It's going to ruin all of our fun. Look at all the corn. All pretty like. Now, to be honest with you, September and October is really decent weather normally in the state of Ohio to ride. And I say normally because who knows what we're going to get. This summer is being cold and wet yet again. Um, it's 72 degrees, says the spider, so it's probably more like 70. And it's 1230, and we're at 70 degrees, and we're just into September. Look at all the pumpkins. I didn't know there was pumpkin patches here. Look at all them pumpkins. Yeah, and I know. I, I got a little squirrel thing going on today. It's okay. I, uh, I haven't been writing, to be honest with you. I um, just haven't been. You know, with everything that's going on, I have been focused on my health, um, getting myself back into the game of life, I, I guess is what we can call it. Um, you know, once I, I started feeling really bad and, and couldn't get around very well, I kind of stopped all activities, to be honest with you. And that was probably one of the worst things I probably ever could have done. Um, so now I'm walking as much as I can and, um, <laughs> well, I still hurt. I'm not gonna lie. Um, my old body reminds me every day. But uh, we're doing it, and then I, you know, any weight you can lose is only gonna help you in the long run. Um, and then it should help me on my rides as well because I won't be so heavy. I won't be as hot. I hopefully I won't overheat as easy. And, uh, you know, I'm, I keep saying, 
you know, this year is the year that I'm just going to ride and ride and ride and ride. Well, this year definitely was not that year, nor was last year. Last year it was due to rain. Uh, this year has been due to the divorce. And, uh, you know, that should be all taken care of here shortly. And then, you know, I, I keep saying one day, and I need to stop saying one day, one day, one day. Because one day just pushes it down the road. And I need to start saying today, I'm going to do this. Um, but, you know, I, I want to get out more on the spider. And uh, not just do a, a few hour ride. The canning shop, is that what that said that was? Um, but I want to I want to get out. I want to get it to Tennessee. I want to head back up to Niagara Falls. That was such a cool ride. That was a challenge. I'm not gonna lie. Um, and I don't even know how many years ago it was. I had the 2014 STS. Um, that poor spider. It was always in the shop. So I didn't do anything to that spider. Did nothing to it. Um, it came with a radiant. Well, it didn't come with a radiant. Oh my goodness gracious! You guys seeing all this crap? Oh, <laughs> uh, that lady was coming hot through there. Um, so I had this STS, 2014 STS. Uh, I got it, and I was like, I'll buy it today if you throw in a radio. But I had to install the radio. You know, it is what it is. Oh, these things turn brilliant red. They're gorgeous. Um, so I didn't do anything with it. I couldn't make it my own. It spent like eight months in a shop, and I didn't even have it two years. So the wife at the time, we were like, hey, let's ride to Niagara Falls. Now, that's not that far away from us, six, seven hours, 350 miles or so. It's under 400 miles. It's, it's very doable in a day. But this thing didn't even have a backrest, okay? <laughs> and, and we rode from Lancaster to, uh, to Niagara and back. Now, coming back, we were both not doing good and, and we didn't do it all in one day we we stayed the night or a long weekend i don't quite remember what uh but coming back i'm not kidding you at some at some time in the ride we were stopping every 30 miles 40 miles um because i just the floorboards how the floorboards i think were angled because they were angled down on that particular model and the seat wasn't as flat as it should have been it was kind of barrel shaped so number one the floorboards hurt my upper back which is quite weird to think that that seating position would actually hurt my upper back but it did and then the seat since it was kind of barrel shaped it um it really hurt my butt i mean it felt like i was getting split in half and it probably had to do with my lower back issues and hip at the time i just was unaware that i had issues um yeah we had to stop like every 30 miles but it, it was a fantastic trip you know and i want to do more things like that you know something that i can do on a, a long weekend um that way i'm not taking you know a week off or 10 days off i can just take a day or two here and there and, and i can hit all of these wonderful wonderful places uh, but niagara is definitely definitely going to be uh back on the list of things I want to see. Little Cola Road. Oh, I know where that goes. Little Cola Road. That goes to um, 374. Woo woo! You hearing the mighty F3? This thing runs so much better. So much better. Almost Black Spider-ish. Not quite. Look out for motorcycles and three-wheel spiders. We going fast, people. We're not going that fast, to be honest with you. I'm keeping it in, uh, I was in third gear, just playing around in third gear. Well, that was it. Too bad we were behind that car. They did good for almost getting run over. Jack run. That'll take me to 180. We'll go this way like I always go. And then we'll turn left. Oh, look at the baby UPS truck. I didn't know they had them that small. That's an old UPS truck. They bought it from UPS. Hmm. That would make uh, one sweet camper van. 
I mean, it's little bitty, but um, I mean, I thought it was a UPS truck. Park that thing at Walmart overnight, move on to the next place. It's really, really super pretty down through here. I don't even know what this thing is. Eagle Wings Lodge. Is there a golf course down here? Hmm. Just gorgeous. That's all it is. Oh, don't hit my nose. Don't hit my nose. Don't hit my nose. All right, all right. Deer crossing. Yeah, I think that's a golf course. No, it's not a golf course. It's just pretty land. Someone has some, some pretty land out here. Maybe it's all part of that lodge. And I wonder if there's like multiple cabins on that property that they rent out. Okay, now you guys tell me when I go over that yellow line. Because I'm looking to my right, and every time I look to my right, I drift to the left, so. Hmm, bug. Oh, it's gravelly. Boom, boom. So, like I said, all the trips are, are put on hold this year, um, and I'm okay with that, I do believe. I'm never really 100% okay with it, but it, I mean, it is what it is. I can't do anything about it. This dude has some like cars, like some older cars. Where's he at? It's down here a little bit more. Like there's some cars. Am I not on the right? I'm not on the right road. Hmm. I'm not on the right road. But there's this guy that's on a corner property like this. I think it's, I don't know the name of the road. It takes you to 13 from 78. And there's some cars in there that I would like to pull out of the yard. Just cars that you just don't see every day. Like an old Beretta. You know, the Corsicas and Berettas. This was the two door, so a Beretta. Oh, I bet that pool is hard to keep warm. And yeah, I'm still literally paying really close attention to the road. So when I stop talking and I'm going kind of quick, that's what it is. I am trying to stay focused. That way I don't run off the road. Man, these glasses are hurting my nose. <laughs> you bark that back tire a little bit with the brakes. Oh, let's see if I can do this again. We're going to turn sharply to the right and then sharply to the left here. Um, yeah, so this helmet, what it's doing is it's uh, rotating forward. So my glasses, the top of the helmet's hitting the top of my glass. Okay, so the top of the helmet's hitting the top of my glasses and it's pushing it down into my nose. So I, I really need to get some different cheek pads or something to tighten this helmet up. That was a lot of pain. That <laughs> was my poor nose. That's a cool little water flowery thing. through here drop another gear oh i should have dropped another gear that's fine them some squiggles on this here road gear that was first gear people yeah we got this little crick I don't know why I like it so much it's nothing special 
it's just this tiny little crick see tiny tiny little crick and then over here when uh, there's no trees it's just cut out of the rock and uh, it, it's spectacular it's just a really really pretty part of the state Like I said, I live uh, in uh, central Ohio, right on the edge of southern Ohio, and uh, the roads are fantastic. And, and Beanie Boy always says, you know, there's just no traffic, and there there's just no traffic on these roads. Now, I can get down here and just chill in traffic if I want, but I, I bypass those roads to hit these roads where hardly anybody ever, ever Where's that big turn at? It's coming up down here. Um, there's just no one lives down here, you know? So I, I hit these roads that are just remarkable to ride. Oh, yeah. It's a Kool Aid Man. Oh, yeah. I'm as big as the Kool Aid Man. Does that count? That's a cool, cool house. To be honest with you, it's the old brick. Or the old block. The block was probably just made down the road. Oh, look at the little falcon up there. Okay, looking for him, something to munch on, or her. Here we go. Here's that big one. Boom. Start downshifting me some downshifts. And the one thing I don't like about this is I wanna, I wanna go boom, 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 and downshift that quick, and it just won't let me. It says, no, you've already downshifted once. You don't get a downshift again that quick. I mean, it, the SE6 could be really, really fun if they just sped it up somewhat. Because it could be quicker than, I mean, it's almost already on the upshifts, on most upshifts, it's already quicker than what my hands can do. Um, just because they're old. So that's the ride today. That's it. I'm going to come down here and I don't know which way I'm going to go. I'm either going to go left or I'm going to go right because that's the only thing I can do. I can't go straight. Um, and then I'm going to listen to some tunes and just chill on my ride. I want to thank everybody for watching today. Whenever I post this, I'm uh, two months behind, but since I haven't been riding, I would probably be caught up here pretty quick, to be honest with you. So I don't know what that means for this winter. Hmm. 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 Well, poo. Magoo. We'll go this way. And it's not a bad ride, you know, because these hills that I'm in, so I'm in this little valley. This is all the Hocking Hill region, and it's just hills. I mean, it's just all it is. It's just really, 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 really pretty. Um, and a lot of people come down here, and they uh, they play and live, and, uh, you know, so do I. So on that, I'm out. Give me a big old thumbs up. Stay safe, everybody. I'll see you down the road. We're going to set the cruise, and we're going to shut this off.